These ones are nice. They're these ones are fake leather. The Doc Martens are real leather. Um, but these are actually pretty comfy, despite the heel. I think it's because of the large platform. shopping for a lady a shopping for a lady for PJs I like my recommendation is Victoria's Secret just because I love them I love the cute PJs that they put out some people would disagree but I don't know I think these are pretty cute and they're nice and long and I wasted I wasted is like the thing right now so So have it's a matching set, so it comes with the shirt as well. It's a little bit of a crop, a little bit of a crop top, but the high waisted pants make up for it. Anyway, these I wore these on Christmas last year. just, I love pajamas. I love, I don't have enough, like, regular pajamas. Usually I just go to sleep in, like, a, I don't know, an oversized t-shirt. But I always, always love pajamas. And of course, if it's for that special lady, you could go a little bit Or if it's for yourself, get whatever you want. But for the sake of this video, we're going to keep it rated G. style. 
personally, I just like the plain, just the plain wine glass, just simple, nothing, nothing fancy, just, you know, plain. sturdy as well. I've always wanted, um, aside from like the plain glasses, I've always wanted a pair of Waterford crystal glasses. They're gorgeous. They're so expensive though. So maybe, <laughs> maybe we're not to save more money. <laughs> but yeah, Waterford crystal, if you're willing to spend the money, I would do that for somebody. They're beautiful goblets, like they're crystal carved. I don't even know. I toured the Waterford Crystal Factory when I was in Ireland a long time ago, back when I was like 18. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And I got, I did get one thing from there. I got a little tiny seahorse. I think I've showed you guys. My Irish, or my St. Patty's Day video. are just the Martha Stewart glasses. I got them at Macy's. We actually, this is actually one of the ones that we had at, or Jason and I had at our wedding, so we kept a bunch of them because, you know, the wedding was at my house or my mom's house, so everything that was there uh, we got for ourselves. would be a good idea for kind of like a house gift. Um, something that I personally would love to is either like a serving tray or like a charcuterie board. This is a really, really tiny one, but it's perfect for like, I don't know, charcuterie for 
Other than like 
seeing what complements their skin tone. You don't have to like match their skin tone. Because seeing, uh, just figuring out what complements their skin tone rather than matching their skin tone um, is probably going to be a lot easier to do. Unless you already know like their foundation color and stuff like that. But anything like this would be nice. This is the Buxom Lip Gloss. Uh, I don't know where it's from. Plumping lip polish. And I don't know what color it is, sadly. But it's, I don't know, it's a very pretty color. Yep, my lips are about to be on fire. As if I really need plumping lip gloss. Actually, I don't even think. Yeah, no, this is mine, but I don't know why I have it. I don't usually use like lip plumping anything just because my lips are already big. Okay, so if you don't want to buy lip gloss, then we also like also like eyeshadow palettes and my absolute favorite eyeshadow palettes of all time pretty much this is all I buy is the naked palettes this one is naked reloaded um, by Urban Decay but um, I use this one the most and I use the ultraviolet one naked ultraviolet the most I also have their smoky eye one as well and they have a lot more um there's like a honey one and there's like a red heat one and uh, like a wild west one anyway i want them all but you know i think you can get them for like 45 dollars and you know I always love having the option of different colors, different colors, different choices, or even different types of neutrals. You can have different shades of brown um, and like peachy green, or you know, different shades of like gray or anything like that. Um, that will help you blend things. And also they come, there's some that are like sparkly. See, I'm wearing like sparkly right now. Um, with a matte brown underneath. So, I absolutely adore eyeshadow palettes, particularly the naked eyeshadow palettes. Um, some people have preferences for others. Um, I know Tarte makes pretty good palettes. Um, Too Faced has some pretty good ones, too. I do have a Too Faced palette. And... palette from uh, Prem. She was my secret Santa last year. Um, but that's okay. Eyeshadow palettes are a wonderful, wonderful gift for that special somebody who loves to wear makeup. So, moving on to a different category, um, gaming. So, if your significant other or, you know, your brother, sister, mom, dad, whatever, is a gamer or niece, nephew, anything like that is into, like, gaming and anything like that, maybe a new, um, a new set of, uh, controllers might be nice. I... I play PC or the Switch, so these are the ones that I have. So something like that might be 
nice. Maybe, um, I don't know, uh, money for a new game or anything like that. Maybe buy them a new game, gift them a new game. Uh, if they have like a PlayStation or an Xbox, that might be the way to go. Or um, if they're a PC gamer, you can always get them a gift card to one of the online platforms uh, like Steam. Anything like that. I know I'd like that. Or a new game for the Switch. New game for the Switch. So, one of my favorite things to play on the Switch is Mario Kart. Um, it's a lot of fun to play with a bunch of people. So, and of course, that needs the more people, the more controllers you need. So, uh, we always love getting new controllers. We only have three right now, so, but we'd love more. When I say we, I mean me and my husband. I'm not talking about we as in just myself. So, um, yeah, I tried playing Animal Crossing. Didn't really like it.
this accidentally flips over, um, it's no good anymore. We already used it, so.